of the year two uh, under Shiano. Talk about your expectations. Uh, the goal is always the same, you know what I mean? Trying to bring a championship to Tampa. But uh, you know, right now, focusing on this offseason program, uh, finishing up this week strong with our kind of mini camp slash OTAs, and uh, you know, it's going good. You know, you gotta you gotta maximize your time. Uh, be very efficient with it. You know, every team in the NFL has the same amount of time we get on here on the field and in the meeting room. So it's about us being efficient and uh, you know getting as much done as we can. So we're going to training camp prepared. Second camps with Josh. Uh, you just know it's a different for him, Justin. Absolutely. Absolutely. You know. Uh, we all came in here last year as our first year in this uh, system, so you know he's way more comfortable this year. You know with the language, uh, you know everything that's required of him, and everybody else going on, all the things around him. And you can see that already his confidence, the way he's directing the field, and that's fun to watch because now he really gets to let his physical tools, uh, you know, take take shape. The comfort level, the confidence is that the, is that how this offense has has evolved the most. Yeah, and it's going to continue to evolve. You know what I mean? We got some new faces out here, some new receivers. Uh, continue to add some depth and uh, different positions, and uh, it's fun because we spread the ball around and get everybody involved. Try to be as balanced as possible, and uh, you know, once we're clicking, uh, we're going to be hard to stop. Mike Williams obviously had the tools to be a good receiver. Uh, how much are you showing him the nuances of, of things that maybe will put him over the top? You know, it's just uh, simple. You know, I just try to be a professional each and every day. Show Mike about you know bringing bringing your work pail, you know, your lunch hat every day, or your lunch pail and your work hat every day, and <laughs> Uh, you know, just coming out here and uh, you know working hard, working on the technique, having a beginner's mentality. You know, taking notes in meetings, um, doing everything you're supposed to do. And no matter how many years you've been in this league, you know, there's always room for improvement. And so I come out here working on my craft, and uh, he sees that. You know, these young guys see that. And uh, you know, I want to. I don't want to be good. I want to be great. And so uh, when you bring that energy every day, you know, other guys feed off that. Hey, I know it's early. What have you seen from Mike Glennon to this point? Um, kid looks good. You know, he's sharp. You know what I mean? He's very, he's very cerebral. Um, this, is a, this is a system that takes some time to get used to, but he's doing a good job with it, handling it well. We're throwing a lot at him, and, uh, you know, he's, he's soaking it in. So, uh, obviously, he's a big, tall guy, strong arm. Um, you know, he's going to be, he's going to definitely have that depth in that position that we need. So, um, it's good to see him do well. Let's talk about your respect level for Mr. Rodriguez and how excited you are about him and another pass. Yeah, again, you know, our organization has done a great job, you know, in the offseason the last couple of years. Just continue to add depth, you know what I mean, bringing in key pieces that we need. You know, Durrell's uh, going to be a big part of our defense. Uh, with the other faces, you know, bringing Deshaun in here as well. And uh, they're going to show up that secondary. You know, they're, they're good, you know, not only pass defenders, but they're good in the run as well. So he's going to be a great leader in that room, great leader on the field for us. And uh, again, continue to make this team better. Looking forward to the practices against him? Oh, absolutely. Personally. You know what I mean? It's, it's, it's nothing one on one on here. We're all out here to get better. Um, whoever we're matched up against, you know, we, we, we do what's, what's asked of us as a team. And so uh, when he's lined up against me, you know, I know he's going to give me his best. I'm going to give him my best. And it's all about, you know, taking care of each other and uh, improving us uh, as a team. How does that help the younger receivers when you're going against guys like that and the upgraded defensive secondary? Because it's a challenge, you know, when, you, when you're going against looks that's, uh, you know, as hard as it's going to be, you know, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, then, uh, then you're going to see on Sundays, um, that's an advantage. And so we got to take advantage of that during training camp when we get ones on ones and uh, really use that to, uh, you know, get our reps, get our timing together, compete a little bit. And so when we get in the season, you know, we're facing guys, you know, each and every practice that as good as guys are better than the guys we're going to face on Sundays. Do you see a change in Greg Shannon's intensity? Has he loosened up at all? No, Greg's the same. Greg's an even kill. You know what I mean? He's going to come in, uh, be very, be very efficient, uh, maximize our time out here, um, and make sure that you know we're doing all the things the right way. Very detail oriented, and uh, I love that. You know what I mean? It, it, it really makes everybody focus in on the job, and uh, he, that's what he always says. Everybody just do your job. Keeps it very simple. Breaks down the game better than anybody I've ever seen. So, um, you know, hats off to him. He's continuing to get better, get more comfortable with the people around him, his coaching staff, as well as getting a better feel for the players. So, um, I expect a you know a great year. Uh, coach.